Hi guys, it's tablenews.com and if you're watching this you probably know what we're dealing with here. We got the Galaxy Note 3, we got the Galaxy Gear and we got this nifty little cradle of the Galaxy Gear and now this is a tutorial for the way of pairing the watch with the device. If you start up the watch you'll see basically nothing happens. For the initial setup you are required to tap this dock here onto the back of the tablet. Beautiful watch by the way and starting it up we're going to review both devices and now let's do what's shown on the screen let's tap this phablet with this device like this okay installation should start we're connected to Wi-Fi we're going to install the required software you can see here the interface of the software the download uh, measures 18.6 megabytes and it will bring options like my apps, Samsung apps, find my watch, settings and more. We'll finally get to display the time on this watch, after all it's the purpose of a watch, among others. Waiting for the download. You've probably seen some similar tutorials on the web, but we wanted to do one that's clear, detailed and uh, filled with explanations. The Galaxy Note 3 is actually lighter than it seems at first sight. Also, it's a pretty beautiful piece of gear and still waiting for that download to complete. Okay, now the installation. So, 19 packages to install, going through them fast. The gear and the note, an appealing package. You may end up spending about $900 or even $1000 on this combo, but you may feel that you won't resist it, especially if they push the marketing further and especially if they do a crazy Black Friday promotion. Okay, here we go. It's connecting. The watch vibrated, everything is okay. Okay, here as well. The connection is happening right now. Okay, we have to acknowledge two things. We understood everything. We're finished and we agree. And welcome, your gear is ready to use. Let's put this here and let's see what the device shows. Okay, as you can see, it's showing the time and the temperature and the date, obviously. And now we have to learn how to work it. Apparently, you can also place calls from it. And as I said, we're still trying to learn how to work it. But this was the pairing tutorial. Now we have to get used to some of the settings that are offered here. So we have a bunch of clocks. You can show this type of analog clock, this one, digital clocks, a pedometer clock, pretty cool show the date or don't show it. I for one am inclined to use this type of analog clock. So this is it. I'm also sure that if you keep it pressed you restart. We got a special outdoor mode as you can see. Contacts, logs, apps. Let's see the settings. Sound volume, display, battery 98%. And once again, trying to learn how to work it. Okay, let's see what other options are available. The pairing is done very easily. I'm really happy that Samsung uh, had this good idea to pair them that easily. You can also interact with S Voice, do some voice memos, some settings for the pedometer, transfer your pedometer data, and some use some special Samsung apps. Of course, you can update your Samsung App Store and go through all the process. But basically, that's the way to connect your beautiful new Galaxy Gear Watch to your beautiful new Samsung Galaxy Note 3. And this is the pedometer, this is the media controller, a gallery, and voice memo, S-voice, notifications, 
and much more things. I have to say that it's a pretty intuitive interface and it answers my commands reasonably well. Okay, we got a camera and you can tap to take pics. I'm not sure if you're seeing this, but we're using the camera as we speak. Okay, had enough fun. A full review is coming for both devices. I'm particularly curious about this one since it's a first from Samsung. And I hope you like this tiny tutorial here at tabletnews.com. For now, it's bye-bye, but then we'll be back with two full reviews. Bye-bye.